News 5. In the wake of the school shooting, one Colorado Springs self-defense instructor is taking action. He's offering a free class tomorrow to equip you and your family with the knowledge you would need in the case of a mass shooting. And News 5's Shayla Gerardin is live at Calvary Family Martial Arts and Fitness with more. Shayla? We all know our natural instinct can be to panic in these times of crises. And luckily, I'm joined by Isaac this morning. This class is all about equipping students to know how to respond. Talk to me about why these skills are so important. You know, we firmly believe that you need to be prepared and not paranoid. The best defense that we can have against these situations is making sure that we have a plan. The fire department for years have used something called a pre-fire plan. It tells them how to address different structures. We need to have some type of pre-plan for any type of active shooter or mass shooter situation. So we're doing that free for the community this Saturday from noon to 1.30. And all they have to do is just RSVP or visiting the website. And you're about to walk us through a very important tactic that you are going to show people uh, tomorrow. Talk to me about, you know, what this is, what our viewers are about to see. Well, the scenario this time, what they're going through is a group dynamic. It could be a, a conference room. You're at work. Somebody's now coming in. They're going to warn everyone that there's an active shooter, and then they're going to do what's called smother and cover. It's nothing fancy. It's just how do you put this guy down quickly, effectively, and make the room safe. All right, and before we go into this, just a heads up to our viewers, some of the sound effects um, are very realistic, so just keep that in mind, especially if there are kids watching. Yes, ma'am. All right, here we go. So in this quick scenario, the whole thing with this is you have someone that hears the gunfire. They're warning everybody else that there is some type of active shooter situation going on. She tried to run. She tried to hide. She came into an area where people are. She shuts the door behind her, tells them, look, there's someone out there that's coming after us with the weapon. Someone has to take charge. So she tells them where to go, gives them assignments, and then they all go in and put that into action. The key thing with this is you have to practice this. So the workplaces, the teachers, the educators, you have to put this in practice so should this ever occur, that people act without thinking. All right, Isaac, well, thank you so much for joining us. It's so important to learn these skills. And you can get that practice in. There will be that free class tomorrow. We have all the information you need to register up on our website, koaa.com and the News 5 app. Watching out for you, Colorado Springs, Shayla Gerard in News 5. Thank you, Shayla. Some great things to know. Let's check in with